just arrived at Singapore Airport. It wasn't a bad journey with Scoot. It's now 8.58 a.m. I believe it's 27 degrees. Definitely very overcast. Uh, good journey. Scoot would not be my preferred option in the future. You can't even get free water. We are inside the Singapore Airport. It's got palm trees. It's very clean. Everyone's cleaning. We have got to check in early, so that is always super awesome. Oh, beautiful. This is our room. Oh, we've got a bathtub. Do you need a bath, Anna? So, down here by the pool. Ah, this is the outdoor pool area. Not bad. Outdoor showers. A nice sitting area here. Paradise pool. place here in Singapore in a shopping centre and it is crazy busy, it's just busy. Everyone's sitting down eating, so many places to eat, so many things to eat, so many things to try, so many places with lines outside as well.
like to swear over there. That is Marina Bay Sands up there. And we're headed down to the light show. This is the inside of the shopping centre. That's the floor down there. There's kids running around down there. Some salads, some juice, juice, and some fruit. Actually, an egg station now. Hash browns that make you an omelet. Some more eggs up here, and there is the noodles to make noodle soups. at the Chinatown markets and it's basically all food everywhere. Indian food, Asian food, Asian food, dim sum over there, coffee over there. This here is where you make the hot pots. Got all the meat in here, the vegetables. And then you choose your noodles. And then you must pay.
So we're at Sato Street at the moment and it is really busy and it smells amazing. Food, food, food. There's some crabs here. The beer jugs. Yum, yum. Yeah, it's busy. So busy here. Everyone, yum. Looking forward to trying something out here. Best satay. Yum. Is that the line? So look at these tables out here. They're like one, two, three, four, five long, and people are just sitting on them eating. And this is the view that you're getting of all of the buildings up here. And here's the satays. Gosh. And what we're going to get is set A, and it's like 28 Singapore dollars for like 26 sticks. People order like. Oh my god, $200 gets 75, 150, 196. So this is what we're ordering, but there is about a 30 minute wait. So we're going to go and have a drink while we wait. Look at these cakes. They're just... I know, that's what they're What are you saying? Crab, crab, crab. So it's the last night in Singapore and I'm going to get a beer from here because everyone seems to be drinking beers and it is boiling hot and I want something cold. So we're at the supermarket and it's a fair price. Where are the biscuits? Where are the biscuits? Oh, here's some drinks. Oh. I'm just having a look in the biscuit aisle. Look at these. Julie's wafers. Julie. Keating. Ah, oh, Biscoff. Sandwich crackers. Oh, they look yum. But I'm actually looking for a particular biscuit that Emma has introduced me to. Over here, locker, peanut butter. I bought some of those for the aeroplane home. But Emma had some ones yesterday that were like lemon locker biscuits. They tasted like the Ferrero Rocher, the white ones, Raphael's. Hmm. So we've checked in early at the Singapore airport. They've actually got a system here that you can, if you've got more than three hours and you've checked in online, you can actually uh, check in anytime you like. So it's uh, 3.30, it's like three hours before we have to be here. We've checked in online and we've popped our luggage on. It's all gone now, we can just walk around for like six hours and do whatever we want. So this is fun. This is way to the Forest Valley. So this is the waterfall in the middle of the airport. Oh my gosh. How cool is this? Oh my gosh, I want to go down there. I want to go down there. <laughs> I don't know you oh my God, and there's a train. That's the one that goes from here to uh, too. I think that's, uh, oh, but it doesn't go to our terminal, does it? No. Look at that guy lying on the ground taking photos. Ah, oh, I want to do that. up there as 
well. Got to say, walking around this airport just reminds me of being at like High Point Shopping Centre. Apart from the fact that there is a waterfall in the middle of the airport. I know. It feels super cool here. We have a little train up here that takes you to Terminal 2. Over here is actually a trampoline that's attached to the roof. Oh my gosh, and we're at the very top here where the waterfall is. Goes down there, you can see the railway line is there, but you've got to actually pay to go over that bridge, so we're not paying. But it's 13 Singapore dollars. Some artwork over there spinning around. Some nice lounge chairs. Automated immigration, like, oh. Seriously, European airports, when obviously this one now, are so good, so handy, and so quick to get things rolling. There's a there's a wishing well over here too. Singapore airport is just full of surprises. Look at the beautiful. Things around here. Gorgeous. I know, how cute. It looks like Chinatown where we were the other day, Emma. These are the toilets. I know, sorry, but it's got um, a dryer there. And there's a little remote control on the side here that lets you wash and dry all your areas when you finish. And then Look at this bathroom, oh my god. Instagram in here.